shnikes! Whew. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> All right, well, we are back at what you can see behind me is what we called the hidden oasis that JP brought me to the last time. As you can see, he's already out there snorkeling. And uh, we actually have another guest with us today, surprise guest. We got Dan came out from Altoona to hang out with us for the day. And uh, I also now, this time, since the last time I was here, have the super long selfie stick. So we can get you some really cool underwater shots with that as well. So, uh, yeah, we're about to head on in there. And uh, it's a lot, actually, yeah, we're about to head in. But as you can see, it's a lot clearer than the last time. And the water level is slightly lower than the last time, too. So he's snorkeling, seeing if he can find anything interesting. And uh, we'll go ahead and head in with you guys. Actually, see where you're stepping this time. What's that? Oh, is there? cold as last time but it's cold but it does feel good because of how hot and sweaty I was You gotta come over here though, see there's a huge crater in the water, like a big hole. Okay. Come over, I'll show you where it's at. Thank <laughs> you. 
really, really clear. A big crater down here that we saw, and there's some fish down there, so I'm glad we were turning the jig because this is by far the best conditions ever. And in the upcoming video, look how that <laughs> in the upcoming video, we're going to go upstream to see what else we can find between here and the water source higher up in the mountain. So make sure you stay tuned for that video. That's actually our intention today is to follow that because you guys asked us to come back and show us what was up there. So we're going to head on up that way, see what we can find. I do not see the rock with the snake under it yet, as I can't see it from here because I don't have my glasses on, so that might not be there anymore. So the snake's probably not there anymore, so we don't have to worry about me screaming like a girl again. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, we're going to head up that way, see what else is up there, and see what we can find and bring you guys along. But That'll probably be in another video. So sorry to disappoint you. So you'll have to wait until the next one to see what's up there. So I wanted to thank you for joining us on this little adventure again of us returning back to the secluded secret oasis in the middle of the woods and uh, enjoy some swimming and be able to actually see underneath the water. And uh, yeah, I can't think today. I can't talk. But uh, yeah, so it was neat to see be able to actually see what's under there and, and Jay let me use his uh, goggles to swim around and look around I think I saw what looked like a uh, possibly a flashlight battery or something I'm not sure what it was I'll have to look well you guys will see it in this footage because I did a close-up on it because I was trying to use the camera to move it to get it to a point where I could pick it up but uh, didn't work too well so it's still down there and uh, yeah so don't forget to check out his channel and his video on this for what he caught underwater too. And we'll put some subtitles in for him. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, make sure to give us a thumbs up, both of us, and uh, say hi to Dan in the comments. So, we'll catch you in the next one. <laughs>